Ja. Alright, the second row. How's it going? Good, good. You alright? Knocked anyone else in the break? Nah, staffy. Got someone in the headlock. Sad. Loving it. You alright? You alright on the sides? Yeah. Did everyone else hear that then, or have I just fucking had a stroke then? <laughs> I heard something, I was like, ah! Someone was trapped in a little tiny box. I, 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 I keep it, no, like normally I'd be alright with that, I keep hearing shit. Like, I've had like six months off work and I did DMT about three weeks before lockdown and I've got fucking mental health problems now and I don't know what's fucking real anymore. Like, and when I hear sounds, because I, oh, like, I can't see fuck all, like, I've just got these lights, I can see basically you, right? And whenever I hear sounds like that, I'm like, this is it, I'm fucking done. Like, <laughs> reality's gonna melt away. I'd fuck, it, it's a, has anyone ever done DMT? Yeah. He yeah. has, you fucking. It, yeah. You're just a grass are you? <laughs> or is he not able to speak anymore? He's just what, just what, one with the serpent. I love it, me. I'm fucking. I, dying. Oh yeah, there you go. That's what you're waiting for. Oh, you, you got two there. What? 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 <laughs> Don't fuck with me like that. I've just said I've got. Do you have a good lockdown or now? Are you working through lockdown or now? Yeah. What are we doing, security-wise? Just, a... just at home, just doing your own security. <laughs> <laughs> just, just fucking, just making sure no one broke in. Just, just sitting there by the door, just going, I'm not asked if the world's fucking over. I'm fucking ready for you, you cunts. Come for me now. <laughs> I wish I'd have had, I mean, I weren't ready for it, mate. I flapped it, mate. Like, I'm normally like, because I, I was on my own for so, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not good at being on my own. I like, I'm, I'm, I'm a crowd person, do you know what I mean? I've done this job for a long time and I do it a lot. I do it like pretty much every night of the week before lockdown. And then I went from that to fuck all and I'm in the house. I fucking, I was doing all right for a few weeks. I was doing sound. I was, I, I was, I was, I was doing yoga and shit. Trying to, I was meditating, trying to keep me, el- trying to keep myself level and shit like that. And then, so what made my head fall off? All my mates are dickheads, like Adam. <laughs> he's a lovely lad. I've known him for ten years, but he's a cunt. He's a dickhead. Like, he, and most of my mates are like that. We're all comedians, and we're all mentally ill, and we're all fucking stupid, right? So I was phoning around all my mates, and we're all having stupid chats, and all, we've all got fucking anxiety and shit, and we're all like, oh, the world's over, uh, but. The one that got me was, right, I've got one mate who's sensible as fuck. He's like the cleverest person now. He owns this comedy club, right? He's a very level-headed guy, very well-planned out, right? And I rang him, I'm on FaceTime, right? And I went, oh yeah, and he went, lad, get on this. And he went in his garden. He's just had all his garden done out nice with all that artificial grass and that. Look, boss, right? And he's covered all that. You know them barrel planters you get from fucking B&M? He's got 16 of them, right? And he's just got them all out in the lines, like fucking Minecraft. <laughs> and I was like, what are you doing? And he went, lad. It's me spuds. <laughs> I went, what? He went, growing spuds. I went, why? In case it goes off, innit? And I was like... <laughs> now, if that was Adam who'd said that, I'd be like, you're a fucking dickhead, you. But because he's a lot cleverer than me, my reaction to that was to go, oh, no. <laughs> I haven't got spuds. <laughs> and I'm flapping it then, because... I, 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 w- I went, lad, I'm gonna have to go here. I'm gonna have to go. I went upon him straight away and I went straight online. I'm, I'm fucking B&M trying to get them. They're sold out everywhere. And I'm like, oh my God, everyone's fucking on it and I'm not on it. <laughs> the shops are gonna close and I'm gonna fucking starve to death and my kids are gonna die. It all flashed. It was like fucking Terminator Judgment Day. <laughs> and I, I, honestly, I was, I, I, I was sat in my house for fucking two days just flapping over it. Didn't know what to do. And then I thought, you know, my, my solution to that was, right, to buy a sword. <laughs> That made total sense to me. In my house, on my own, I talked myself into buying a fucking sword, right? Because my thinking was, right, like, I don't give a fuck how hard you are. <laughs> you might be hard as fuck, and you might be fucking boss of security in that, right? But you sat in your house, and you thought, I've had a boss idea. Do you know what? It's going to go off. I'm going to buy 16 battle planters. I'm going to grow some spuds. You're thinking you're fucking smashing it, aren't you? Do you know what I mean? You put them all in. You put your soil in and that. you got fertilizer. You put your little seeds in. You think, three months' time, I'm going to have jackets for fucking days. Jacket for your ma. <laughs> jacket for your dad. Everyone's got fucking chips all day. But then I turn up with a fucking sword. <laughs> Not so hard anymore, are you kid? <laughs> What's happening then? I've got fucking spuds and a fucking sword, haven't I? <laughs> You're watching me eat fucking chips, kid. 
Never done it though. Never done it, right? Only because I was this close to buying one, but I couldn't decide which one I want because I'm very indecisive. Like if, when I'm buying anything, I flap over it. Like I'll fucking, I'll watch YouTube for hours, you know, like people unboxing shit and that. You know, like have you ever seen them little hand videos where they're like, oh, this is the fucking, you know, when you're buying a phone and that and you start taking the phone out of the box and that. I watch them for days, I find them, they're relaxing and that. I, I, I watch people unbox shit that I've already got. <laughs> And I'm watching people unbox swords, right? And then, like, explain what's the best sword for, like, home defense. And I couldn't decide whether to get a katana, which is like a Kill Bill sword. Or, like, a Viking one, because a Viking one, you've got two cutting edges on it, so you can swing both ways like that. <laughs> <laughs> like, you two swing both ways, that <laughs> And I couldn't decide what to buy. And I was watching, I was watching this dude's fucking YouTube channel. He had about eight views on it. I think I'm the only person who ever watched it, right? And he's just in his garden, just for you know, one of them, one of them fucking Bob fucking punch bags, and he's just going, ah! And he's hitting him with the sword, going, look at the damage this has done. And I was like, this is fucking incredible. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna buy loads of swords and make these videos. This is my new career. This is what I'm gonna do. I shaved my head and everything. And I was like, I'm gonna be a fucking Viking. I'm gonna buy one. I'm gonna have a hatchet for this hand so I can block. And I, I was just, I, all this shit was going through my head, right? And I thought, I'm going to sleep on it. But I've been having dead vivid dreams since the DMT for some reason, right? And I had a mad dream. I went asleep, like fucking YouTube, I'm watching it. And I fell asleep. And I had this weird dream that in the dream, the world had ended, right? And the Ketwigs had took over. <laughs> if you don't know what a Ketwig is, like a chav. Like, like the Scallies. And for some reason in Liverpool, the Scallies just all decided at one point to just all have long hair for some reason, right? And now they all ride up and down on scramblers against traffic. They're just like, wham, 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 wham. <laughs> and I knew they were there because I live in quite a quiet street, mate. And I was just, I was walking out of my bedroom in the dream, and I just said, wham, 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 and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> the cat wigs are here. <laughs> and I went to my blinds and I looked out and I could see them, wham, 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 just wheeling at mums with prams and that, and his mums were running away. And I was like, fuck it out. And one started wheeling at my front door and that, and I was like, shit. And he's wheeling, but he's knocking on my door because they're dead good on them scramblers, right? <laughs> I mean, you've got to respect the core strength they've got, the fucking acrobatics, do you know what I mean? <laughs> and he comes through my front door, and I was like, fuck. And I remember that I'd, I'd bought a katana, right? I'd gone the katana route, Kill Bill style. So I grabbed it, and I went, <laughs> and I made a fucking boss noise, and I was like, ah! And I ran down my stairs and I'm stood in my hall like that, right? And he's there by my door and he's like halfway in. He's like, rum, 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 rum. Dream is amazing, right? <laughs> Panned round into like a side shot so it was like Street Fighter, right? And I was at one end and he's at the other and he's like, rum, rum, rum. And I'm like, come on then, you cunt. <laughs> and he started coming at me and I started running at him. I was like, ah! Like that. And I screamed as loud as I could and I swung the sword at him. And the real flaw in the plan struck me in the dream because what happened was a katana is like five foot long and I have got low ceilings. <laughs> so I swung his eyes as I could and I went fuck off and the katana just stuck in the ceiling and he ran me over. <laughs> Drove straight past me, went into my garden and took all my spuds. <laughs> Never done it. <laughs>